Good evening to all my wonderful viewers out there and welcome back to another drop list video, the series where I cover all the items that are releasing in a specific week for various different streetwear brands. And in today's video, I'm going to be covering everything that is dropping in week two of Palace's Spring 2023 collection. Uh, but before I can start talking about week two of Spring 23, I've got to thank you guys once again because you came through over the weekend and helped the channel reach the subscriber milestone that I asked if we could hit before the end of February, which was 3,570 subs. So I just wanted to come out and thank the public and private subscribers for supporting the channel over the weekend. You guys are fantastic. You are fantastic. We reached 3,570 with your guys' continuous support and surpassed it as well. Hopefully, with your guys' continuous support, we can hit the next milestone that I'm going to set, which is just five more subs. I hope that we can hit it before Friday, because I've actually got to go to a music festival on Friday, which is why I'm doing this video so early. Uh, if we could hit that subscriber milestone before Friday, that would be awesome. If not, before the end of the month is okay as well. But let's see if we can hit 3575 before the end of this week. All right, so let's start talking about week two. So obviously, the Friday gone, we had the big first drop of the spring 23 season. Uh, you guys seem to be picking up a lot of the pieces that dropped in that first week. We're now moving into the regular weekly drops, which are obviously a lot smaller than week one. And now we're moving into the second week. Uh, this week, we're getting a collaboration with, uh, it's Ramoa, isn't it? The, um, how, how have you pronounced the, uh, the luggage brand? That one there, the one that all the uh, big streetwear brands and luxury brands always collaborate with because, well, I guess they must make good quality travel bags, I suppose. But uh, yeah, they are collaborating with Palace to do just a couple pieces for week two. It's not a whole uh, collaborative week two drop. It's just um, a couple collaborative pieces mostly seasonal pieces. We'll cover it all when we use the Max Merch More Instagram post to cover the whole week. We'll cover the release details, all the individual pieces, both seasonal and collaborative, and my thoughts and opinions on the individual pieces and the week as a whole. Let's head on over to the Max Merch More post now, and we'll start covering the release details for week two. So here we are at the Max Merch More Instagram post that we'll be using today, guys. If you want to check out the post yourself or you want to, you know, check out Max Merch More, I'll link the post down in the description section below. So Palace Spring 23, week two expected drop list. All items will be releasing this Friday, February 10th, 11 a.m. GMT time, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, most likely on the Thursday, just like how it was last week, Max Merch More will be posting a estimated price list, although they haven't really alluded to it in this post, but I assume they're going to go down that route. Little unsure, but definitely stay tuned to Max Merch More to see if a price list will be posted for these items here. Uh, now that we've covered all the release details to do with week two, if you have any further questions, drop them in that comment section now and I'll try and help you out the best I can. Uh, the only thing I really have to add to these details that we have is that um, it'll be dropping the day later on the Saturday uh, for Japan and China. Japan gets it uh, 11 a.m. Japanese Standard Time in store and online. China gets it via the WeChat store, which is palace underscore skateboards. Um, Sometimes they get it in a physical in-store like pop-up shop, but that's not a regular weekly occurrence. That's mainly for special events for China. But uh, yeah, that's everything I really got to say about those release details. Now we got to get into week two's pieces. Let's check them out, guys. Let's dive into week two and see what we're getting for this second week. Right, so here we are, uh, zoomed in. We can see that this is the collaborative luggage that we're getting with uh, Ramoa. Um, we can see a palace triferg on what looks like a Mars background with an individual looking at the uh, triferg logo there. Again, I'm not hugely blown away by luggage and I don't come to palace to buy luggage, so it's kind of like, eh, okay, cool. Uh, moving on into the seasonal pieces, we have the uh, Pertex P90 puffer jacket coming in a tan camo and black. Uh, it's it's an alright puffer jacket. I do like the font on the, um, I, I'm going to assume a kangaroo pouch along here. Uh, yeah, it's nothing too crazy, but it's alright. I'm sure a lot of you guys will get around it. 
Next we have the Face Mask Sherling Thermal Hood in a grey. It does come in a series of other colours. Uh, I think showcasing it here is the best way to really dive into the details. So when it says Sherling, I'm assuming that the inner lining here along here is the Sherling material. The Thermal Hood will be the Thermal, uh, well, I guess hood or mask that comes with it there. Uh, that's all the assumptions that I'm making with it. I think the gray on gray is the nicest color. I don't know if I'm really like keen on these color combinations that they've chosen. This like olive with the red, this mustard, well this orange with the black, it's almost a mustard. Uh, we've got a brown and red. We've got the, oh maybe the navy and gray is all right. Actually the black on black. Let's just look like a ninja. Let's do it. Uh, face mask, black on black, Sherling thermal hood. Yeah, I think that's probably the way to go with that one. It just looks better with the matching, you know, face mask to hoodie, in my opinion. Maybe you guys disagree, which you're totally welcome to. Uh, moving back up, we've got the Cycle Knit, um, a knit which, judging from the title, features cycling jersey uh, prints and designs onto a knit zip-up cardigan, and they also trail onto the back as well. It comes in a blue, a white, a navy, and I think that's the only colors. I think the white and the navy are definitely the better of the uh, three colors showcased here, but there are other cardigans that I'd, I think I'd be more keen on than this one here, but not necessarily a bad design here. Moving forward, here is the collaborative uh, skateboard that is releasing uh, as well this week. Uh, next, we've got the something tech shell ear flap runner crystallized blue is the color that it comes in. Um, yeah. Okay, not really for me. I'm not a huge fan of like ear flap caps and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, that's everything releasing in page one of week two, guys. Let's press on to page two. Ah, Paltech. <laughs> I could only see the AL and I was like, I don't know what that is. Paltech, the Paltech shell ear flap runner in the black. Eh, it's all right. It's not blowing me away. We got the Triferg patch beanie in a duck camo and coming in various other colors as well. Comes in a hot pink, blue, mojito, uh, tan and black. It's a nice beanie. It's a nice simple palace beanie with a Triferg patch on it. You can't complain about that. I think I'd get it in the black on black. The other colors aren't doing too much for me, but black on black is nice. Uh, we got the, I'm gonna assume that says Gore-Tex, Infinium Dog Ear six panel with the, the the tree camo i don't know man look not for me not for me maybe for you guys it's a yes but uh <laughs> i'm i'm good i'm good with this one um yeah but each to their own i think my favorite piece on page two is going to go to just the trifog patch beanie black on black solid but uh yeah i'd love to hear your thoughts on page two let me know what your favorite piece is here we'll move on to page three and there's not much, not much on page three, but we'll talk about it anyway. We've got the Gore-Tex Infinium Dog Ear 6 panel coming in a deep purple, a black, a gray. Um, yeah, it hasn't changed much for me. I'll just make a note as well that the ear flaps have a zip pocket on the side there. Kind of a cool extra detail there, but not a selling point for me at all. Uh, at least with the Gore-Tex material, it's going to be a high quality hat for sure with a lot of we weatherproofing to it, but yeah, not my style of hat. And last but not least, we have what looks to be the sticker patch, if this is what this is uh, referring to here, which I assume it is, uh, a little sticker patch there, or sticker capsule. But um, yeah, that is everything releasing in page three and everything releasing in week two, guys. Uh, as I said, it's a lot smaller of a week compared to week one, but as I'm always saying with every season we cover, week one's always the biggest season. Um, so we had the, the dog ear flap caps on the last page. We had the Triferg beanies and the uh, Paltech ear flap runner. We had all the other pieces featuring here on the first page. Uh, I don't think there's anything that's really tickling my fancy this week, but in saying that, I wasn't planning on spending any money on Palace this week because as I said at the start of the video, got a music festival to go to. <laughs> I gotta go see a Genesis Awusu, uh, DMAs, um, yeah, like so many artists. And actually some of my mates are performing as well. So yeah, lots of awesome things to come with that. Not looking to spend money on streetwear and fashion this week, but maybe you guys are different. Maybe you guys don't have a festival lined up. Maybe Palace is what you've got lined up and I wanna hear from you. Let me know what you're feeling from week two or if week two's a hit or not down in that comment section below. 
Well guys, that's everything really to cover about uh, week two of Palace's Spring 2023 collection. We covered the release details. It's releasing Friday or Saturday, depending on your region. 11 a.m. in their respective time zones. 11 a.m. GMT time for the UK. 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time for the US or 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time for the US if you live on the Eastern, Eastern side. Uh, it's 11 a.m. Japanese Standard Time for the for the Japanese, 11 a.m. Chinese Standard Time for the Chinese. I, I'm trying to remember it all off the top of my head. <laughs> I've been covering this this brand for years now. I should know that off the top of my head. But yeah, um, we covered all the items releasing in it, both collaborative and seasonal. And we covered my thoughts and opinions on the individual pieces and the week as a whole. Um, nothing too crazy here for week two. I, I saw some comments on the post saying, a nice week to skip, and I was like, yeah, I get that. There's nothing really here for me either. But um, yeah, I wanna hear from you guys. I wanna hear from the people that are looking to pick up something this week. What are you looking to pick up? Are you feeling the knits? Are you feeling the face mask hoodies? Or are you feeling like some collaborative palace luggage? Let me know what you're gonna be picking up in the size and color down in that comment section below. And of course, if you guys want to keep covering upcoming Palace releases, collabs, all that good stuff, you know what I'm going to say. You know what I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask you for the three indicators I always ask you for. A like on this video, a comment in the comment section down below, and if you haven't already, a subscribe to the channel. As I talked about at the start of this video, we are aiming for 3575. If we hit that, that means I get to update this little bad boy here because we hit a new 25 sub milestone there. So, you know, help, help the fellas out. Let's see if we can hit it before the end of the week. I believe in you guys. Let's see if we can hit 3575 at least before the end of the month. Well, I wish you all well for week two. I hope you guys managed to pick up the items that you were after in the size and color you're after. But until the next Streetwear Talk video, until the next drop list video, until the next Palace Skateboards videos, guys, I'll catch you later.